Hello, Assalamualaikum. Uh, it's very nice to meet you again. It's me, Inner Mom of Ayaran. Today, I'm going to show you how to make a tote bag, especially if uh, we made of uh, burlap and brocade. Well, but before I start, please support my channel by uh, subscribe, give your thumbs up, uh, like, and share. Thank you. Well, let's get, let's get started uh, with the supplies. Here yeah, I've already prepared the burlap and I already ironed it with the in the uh, facing. And this is uh, the brocade we want to cover the burlap with it. Uh, for the detail of the material, you can uh, see on this uh, video description I uh, already write it down there and this is the fall leather for the base of the bag and we will also use this foam to uh, for the base and this is a piece of uh, fabric to cover it okay this is this uh, this are bias for the side of the bag this is a bias for uh, the top of the bag and this uh, set of handles and I made it from the uh, for leather also and this is a set of for the ring holder and we also need uh, to prepare a set of uh, straps for the strap making you may watch uh, my previous video i've already made a, a tutorial i have already made the tutorial for uh, straps making and this is for the lining of the bag i we uh, we use uh, this is a zipper a zipper and also we have to uh, prepare the uh, fabric and the zipper for uh, inside pocket okay first this is how I uh, start uh, making the zipper first I fold the tip of the zipper just make a couple of stitching to uh, hands to keep it uh, in place and uh, as usually uh, put the right side of the fabric uh, to the right side of the zipper you may put the slider on it and then just uh, put the lining on it and the their good sides uh, is together and we can pin it so it will it will line up And this is how to uh, arrange the the end of the receipt zipper. Just fold it. Then so uh, all around the edge. And as usually, we have to top stitch it. Do the same process for uh, the other sides.
Okay, for the inside pocket, uh, it will be about 8 cm from the top of the lining. And the opening will be 20 by 1 and a quarter centimeters. You may watch uh, the detail of uh, the pocket making on my and other videos. My previous videos, I already made it with two kind of uh, um, with uh, two types of the opening. Okay, uh, the lining with the inside pocket is ready, and this is a zipper uh, as well. Now it's time to join them. First, this is how I join. Okay, well, we will uh, sew the base, but before we have to make uh, the ring the holder, and this is how I made it. I just uh, fold it uh, twice, the fold it, just fold it twice, and then uh, put uh, slide the red ring inside, and then uh, stitches. We can uh, put the, the slider off and uh, don't forget to uh, place the seam right on uh, opposite uh, and then we put the holder on it and the distance is about uh, three and a half centimeter from uh, the top of uh, the lining. Stitching off the, the ringy holder. Now we can put it on um, the slider back on its uh, position. Okay, the main interior is ready, but we haven't sewn the base yet. So this is how I sew the base. Just put, uh, just match the center and you can put pin on it or just clip it and then we start sewing Okay, uh, for the corner we have to make a small cut, so it will lay uh, neat.
Well, uh, we're done with the in main interior. Now it's time to uh, work with the main exterior. Here we are. I've already prepared the burlap with the stabilizer, which is uh, and this is how I cover the. Uh, this is how I cover it with the burlap, uh, with the brocade. I pin it and then I start. Uh, stitches well stitches uh, so far time just like when you make an quilting okay it's now time to chain them just put the good side together and then start stitching their edges We will show the uh, bias, but before we show it, uh, we can use a double tape or glue to keep uh, the bias on it on its position. Well, now it's time to uh, join the uh, base to the main exterior. Uh, the the, uh, the process is the same with the previous one with the lining. Uh, first, before we start, it, we, before we stitch it, we have to put their center uh, in line. And this is how to make the cover of the foam for the base. Uh, stitch it all around the edges and don't forget to let some unsewn as an opening to put the foam inside.
crochet and then we will uh, stitch it to the base to the base of uh, our bag. Okay, but before I start sewing, um, uh, I recommend you to change the pressure foot with uh, with this one side uh, zipper foot. Okay, this is uh, the reason why I suggest you to change the, the pressure foot into the one side uh, zipper foot because uh, it with the one side zipper foot uh, it is uh, possible for us to uh, stitch as close as possible to the form and the precisely on the stitch uh, we've made before. Okay, now it's a time to uh, put your handle on your main exterior. Here I take uh, it's about seven centimeter from the top of your main of from the top of the main interior exterior, and it is also seven from uh, the center of the main exterior. But it is uh, depend on your on the length of your uh, handles. And instead of uh, uh, stitching, uh, now I will use rivets to join the main interior with uh, the straps and this is how I use uh, double rivets but we have to sure that the barrel the length of the barrel is uh, uh, suitable for the thickness of uh, the main exterior and plus the thickness of uh, the straps with the uh, strap now it's time to uh, join the main exterior and the main interior just put the main interior into the main exterior and then uh, as usually we have to keep the center in line so we can adjust it if there's uh, something wrong with the length of our back And then we will uh, sew all around uh, and after that uh, we put the bias on it but as usually you can use your double tape to, to have your bias uh, stick on it please and then uh, don't forget to dip some oil okay for the finishing we have to put on uh, the and tap to the ends of the zipper and you can add some details such as uh, nice um, or beautiful tassel on it and then just it okay uh, let me continue my works <laughs> and as you see it's very easy you can uh, get it done by yourself and 
but of course uh, before I end this uh, tutorial please subscribe my channel uh, give me your thumb ups uh, share and uh, leave your comment below I will be very glad to hear what kind of bag you want to make and well see you on my next tutorial uh, thank you for watching assalamualaikum stay safe stay happy Bye!